Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be doing an ASOS haul because at the end of the day ASOS are in sale and there's absolutely tons of things that I could have ordered but I've kind of searched my way through and picked out a handful of things that I really love and yeah, I'm just going to show you exactly what I bought and then style them later on. Okay, so here is the box. So I'm just going to bring it over here, it's so heavy because there is shoes in there, but yeah, I'm just going to get straight into it, I've just opened it up now with some scissors, and yeah, I'm really excited. So, oh, the very first thing is um, actually an accessory, so it's this here, so this is a hairband actually, and I'm really loving hairbands at the minute, actually I've got one in right now, conveniently, um, for this video, but yeah, this was in the sale, and I think it was £4.50, so I think they're a really good thing to have when you're like yeah I'm, I'm just gonna go out here like I didn't wash my hair this morning because I washed it yesterday and you know when you've got like second day hair they're just a really good way to like shove your hair up and then still make it look really pretty so yeah I picked up another hairband so this is it here it's just this like sort of it's like a chiffon sort of material but it's just so nice it's like this really lovely greeny blue color and has this gorgeous pink floral on it so I could definitely imagine wearing this especially when you've got like a plain outfit on just stick it on and it's just a lovely bit of detail so yeah really nice like this so next we have a top oh yeah so this is the ASOS vest with lace-up sides and I picked this up in a size 10 just because it had lace up sides I was like I would hate it to be like tight and not have enough room to sort of like fall like a nice cami if I was tying it so I just decided to go for 10 um, this was also available in white but I decided that I have more white tops than black so I went for the black one okay so this is it here so it's just kind of like obviously a plain black v-neck and I really like the fact that it's a v-neck on the back as well because often it can be like a round neck at the back with just the v at the front but I like it when it's both and then you can see at the sides it has these like gold rings that sort of lace up and the tie is obviously undone right now but yeah I just thought this was a really nice top that's you know got a little bit more going on if you're going out just with some black skinnies I think this would be a perfect sort of go-to top for when you're just going out for drinks or out for dinner that kind of thing so yeah I really like this and I think this was about £10 so next I decided to go for some trousers now these are I don't know I was a bit confused because they didn't say jeans and um, they actually describe them as ASOS ankle length stretch skinny trousers so I really like the sound of them and um, these were actually full price so they were £25 um, but I just you know you can never have enough black sort of skinny trousers or jeans so I decided to pick these up um, Right, so these definitely just feel like skinny jeans. I don't know why they're not classed as jeans. Um, so this is some here. Oh, they're actually high-waisted. Um, don't know how I feel about that. I prefer non-high-waisted things. But nevertheless, I'll give them a try. So I picked these up in a size 10. And they look quite small, to be honest. I would think they were like a size 8. But yeah, they feel really good, actually. They feel like a nice sort of stretchy material. And I've noticed they have a zip here. So maybe, I don't Oh, that's a pocket. How interesting, they never usually have pockets on the side, that's a bit weird. Um, so they have a side zip pocket, bizarre. Um, but yeah, I do quite like these actually, they look nice, they kind of look like the Joni jeans from Topshop. Um, but like I say, they feel good and they feel like a nice sort of tight stretch, so something that's going to like pull you in and keep you like super skinny. <laughs> um, but yeah, and I like the fact they were like a cropped at the ankle thence, so I think I definitely get a lot of wear out of these. So I'm going to hope they fit me and I'll see how I feel about the high waist um style once I've got them on so the first pair of shoes I picked up are these so these are ASOS's own brand and these are actually full price so I just absolutely fell in love with these if you watch my channel you'll know that I absolutely love leopard print and I wear my leopard print loafers all the time they were from Topshop like a couple of years ago so when I saw the backless versions on ASOS I was like oh absolutely love them so I know they're something that I definitely get a lot of wear out of they're the sort of like faux um like faux hair material so I really like that but yeah absolutely love these I think they're the perfect thing just to add like a little like pop of print or colour to an outfit and I really find that leopard print pretty much suits everyone like it's kind of like a neutral print if that makes sense because it's beige and black but yeah really like this Um, what I would mention is I got a size 6 in these because I always size up in backless loafers just because I think there's nothing worse than if they look kind of like too small and your foot's hanging off the end so yeah I always just size up just for safety but yeah really like these and hoping they're going to be super comfortable so here I actually 
actually have on three things from the haul. So first I have on the top with the ties at the side. Then I have on the skinny trousers, which are obviously like cropped at the ankle, and the leopard print loafers. So I've just styled this outfit with this blazer, which is from Miss Selfridge. I just thought this would sort of be the perfect jacket because it's a bit longer and I just really like the way it looked. And obviously I've picked up a handbag to give it a pop of colour. So yeah, I really like these pieces. And um, the top is really comfortable. I love the fact it's a V at the front and the back. And the trousers are really comfortable. They're like so soft, but they're still skinny and have plenty of stretch in them. So I think they'd be really good for anyone, to be honest. I, don't, I couldn't imagine anyone finding these uncomfortable. And although they are high-waisted and I don't usually like high-waisted, I actually really like the fit of these. And finally, with the loafers, well, so far, so good. I couldn't really tell with shoes um, at this stage whether they would hurt my feet or anything. But so far, they feel really comfortable. Um, I'm definitely glad that I did size up and go for the size 6, just because I think with um, backless loafers, and especially if they're pointed um, toe, it's always better to have that little bit of extra room. So if I just turn around, you can see exactly what this looks like from the back. And then if I just take off um, my blazer and show you the top, so here is the top on its own. As you can see, it's a really nice length and I love the way it flows. I'm definitely glad I went for the size 10 so it's not too tight anywhere. And obviously if I just turn to one side, you can see exactly what the little uh, tie detail looks like. So overall, um, some really good finds and I really like the way this outfit looks. So this is the ASOS Petite Maxi Dress with a popper detail. So yeah, I remember this one actually. When I saw this online, I really liked it because I was like, oh, that would be perfect to wear in like a casual manner with like leather jacket or just some kind of jacket over the top and um, I got petite just because I am about five foot four and normal length maxi dresses can sometimes be really long and I kind of wanted this where it kind of goes just above my ankles I could wear something like cool trainers or boots with it or something like that so this is it here it's like a jersey material and um, if I just lift it up slightly you'll be able to see these big silver poppers that go all the way down now I absolutely love that detail I just think it's really nice I wear silver jewelry all the time so I thought it would be a really nice um sort of dress to have in my wardrobe so yeah all around a good sort of basic and I can sort of see myself wearing this quite a lot so I'm happy with this and um, I think it was about 18 pound or 20 pound in the sales so these boots are actually full price and they are 60 pound but when I went onto my account I had a five pound voucher and I'd really wanted these for a while so I decided to go ahead and order them so these are they're actually called the ASOS Asher leather studded ankle boots so I think you'd have definitely seen these from like a lot of brands. I know Office and things like that sell very similar ones. So this is the boot here. So obviously it's just all studded all around. It has three buckles down the middle. Um, it does have a zip up the side, so obviously they're super easy to get on. And then it's really cute because it has stood sort of like on the inner um, sole, which I really like that detail, and up the back as well. So yeah, I'm hoping these fit. Um, they do definitely smell of leather, so that's good. You know they're like good quality and stuff. Um, so I'm excited to try these on see exactly what they look like and see if they're actually as nice as I thought they were they're kind of one of these things where like I've wanted them for a long time but I'm not sure how much I'd actually wear them so I love studs I love ankle boots so hopefully I'm gonna love these so here I have on the maxi dress with the popper details and I really really love this dress it's exactly what I hoped for it's super casual something I could wear in the day with my biker jacket as I like to wear maxi dresses so yeah I'm really happy with how this has turned out I've also popped on the studded boots and I really like these I'm really glad that I went for the five because there was a five and a five and a half I was kind of thinking mm, should I size up a bit but no the five fit perfectly so they definitely are true to size and they're actually really comfortable they just look really smart and they're not too like bulky although they have a lot of like detail and studs and um, obviously they have the buckles they still look really quite like slim line on your foot so yeah I really like this dress and um, if I take off my jacket um, I'll give you an idea of what it actually looks like from the top so here is what it looks like without a jacket. Obviously it's more of like a vest cut, which is nice because it means you're not going to get too hot. And um, it's really easy to like move in, it's not too restricting. I was kind of worried it was going to be too fitted, but it's just that lovely in between where it's sort of fitted, but sort of like loose as well. So yeah, I really, really like this one. I definitely recommend. Um, I picked this up in a size eight, so I'd say it's quite true to size in sort of dress terms. 
So the next thing that I picked up is also from ASOS's own brand. So this is the ASOS Super Oversized Lightweight Sweatshirt. This is actually new in, like brand new in, but it was £20 and obviously I get my student discount so for me it was £18. Um, I just really like the sound of it, like I kind of thought with culottes or maybe over skinny jeans, it just looked like a really cool thing to sort of chuck on. So if I just open it up. Yeah, it is. It actually is like a really thin sweatshirt material. Okay, so I got this in a size 8 and it is huge. So maybe size down. I mean, it did say super oversized, but because I'm usually an 8 or a 10, I was like, well, I'll go for an 8. So then that's sort of plain it safe. But this is ginormous. So I'm going to have to see how this looks. Um, so yeah, that's basically it. It just has normal plain sleeves. It is cuffed at the bottom. Obviously, it has this sort of like cuffing detail around the neck. And yeah, it just goes plain straight down, long sleeves. So I'm excited to see how this looks. Hopefully it won't look too crazy big when it's actually on. <laughs> So here I have on the super oversized long sleeved sweatshirt from ASOS and I absolutely love this like I was a bit like mm, I don't know how I'd wear that like it literally looked huge but now I've got it on I've kept on the cropped skinnies obviously the leopard loafers and I've popped on a sort of cargo jacket and I really like this combination I think it's super relaxed it's super comfortable and just something I'd wear on a sort of day to day basis um, if I just turn around that's exactly what it looks like from the back but if I just take off my jacket so I can give you a better idea um so yeah so this is it obviously it's super creased and it is really big but I actually quite like how it's really long and stuff and like I say it's just really casual super easy to wear and I probably wear this quite a lot and um, I really like the fact it's got a slit up the side as well so you're not sort of like boxed in or anything it's still giving it some shape but yeah this is also available in grey if you do really like this one so the next thing I picked up was a maxi dress so this is it here it's just plain black and it's in this sort of sweatshirt material so this is ASOS's own brand so it's literally just plain it goes all the way down to the bottom but then if you turn it round um, it has a sort of cut out at the back and it sort of cinches in at the waist at the front so it has these lovely ties that kind of hang down I don't think you actually tie them but yeah I just really like this um, it's really thick the material so like now I'm feeling it I don't feel like I could wear it in the summer like on holiday when it's really hot I think it'd just be too warm so maybe I'd sort of keep this for in the UK and I could wear it with like some trainers and like a denim jacket or something like that and I'd still definitely be warm enough but yeah I'm excited to see how this looks um I'm hoping it looks good but it's a bit of a weird material for maxi dress so I'm just gonna have to see that I've got on the maxi dress which I thought was for the beach but I'm pretty sure it isn't because it's such a thick sort of sweatshirty material and um, I've just popped it with the leopard loafers and this yellow bag and um, but yeah I really like this I like the fact it sort of cinches in at the waist it's a nice bit of detail and obviously it's got these like cool sort of strings that kind of hang off and tie together and um, if I just turn around you can see that it's got the slit uh, cut out at the back and the slit that goes up at the bottom but yeah in general I really like this I can imagine myself going shopping in this that kind of thing it's like a cool way to wear a maxi dress but stay a little bit warmer because it is this like sweatshirt material okay so the next two things are probably the brightest things that I've ever sort of ordered or brought into my wardrobe ever that's if I keep them but yeah so the first thing is this top now as you can see it is literally the brightest pink ever um, I picked this up in an 8 and this is a sweatshirt with peplum hem and this is from a brand called Nobody's Child this was reduced to £7 so I was like mm. You know, maybe if I want some pink in my wardrobe, this is the time to get it when it's on sale. Uh, this is really hard to open. There we go. So, yeah. Okay, so this is literally hot pink. So, when I bought these, I was kind of thinking about wearing all black or black and white. Like, definitely not mixing colours. Um, so, this is it here. It's just a plain, sort of basic top. It just has long sleeves that have a bit of a cuff at the bottom. And then it has this cute little frill that goes all the way around. So, yeah. I do actually really like this. Um, it is very unusual for me to get something this bright. But hopefully, styled in the right way, it could actually look really nice. So, yeah. I'm excited to try this on in see exactly what it looks like so here is the bright pink 
top and I actually really like it like I really like the fit of it I love the little frill and um, I've just kept on the skinny trousers from ASOS and I've popped on my newest Superga sort of platform espadrilles these are on the sale on ASOS as well so I will be sure to link these down below they're actually half price but yeah for £7 I really like this top it's super casual this is exactly how I'd wear it it's just sort of like fun to have a bit of colour in your wardrobe if I turn around you can see exactly what it's like at the back so for me it's a really nice length the sleeves aren't too long either which is always good because I hate when the sleeves are too long but yeah I really like this it's it is very bright and it might not be everyone's style but personally I think it's quite just a fun piece to have in your wardrobe in the summer so like I literally added that top to my basket and then I, for some reason I was like I really want more pink in my wardrobe so I like filtered everything out to pink and I saw this coat which I was like oh my goodness I really want that in my life <laughs> so this is a hot pink coat and I mean this is hot pink like it's even pinker in real life so this was £26 in the sale and I'm just going to add right now this was available in black so if it's a nice fit maybe I'll swap this for the black one so it was classed as a boyfriend sort of fit coat. So this is it here. It's like a sort of like wool coat. Obviously it's just got your basic collar detail. And then it has these really sort of, if I can even get this in the shot, has some really cool zips going down the side. So I really, really like that. Um, but yeah, again, this is something that I definitely only wear if I was wearing like all black or black and white, just keeping it super simple and then adding this really bright coat. I mean so here I have on the bright pink coat and I'm just going to say it straight away, I really don't like this coat. Um, when I got it out I really like the feel of it, obviously it is a very bright colour, but now I've got it on I'm just, I don't know, I don't like the fit of it. Like it's only a size 8 and I'd probably sometimes go for a 10 in a jacket, but I feel like it feels like quite bulky, I don't really like the fit of it, so yeah it's really just not working out for me. Um, nevertheless I sort of styled it if I was to wear it, so I've just popped on black skinnies, um, a striped t-shirt and some black boots in a handbag but yeah I mean maybe this would fit you better so that's just my opinion so if I show you what it looks like from the back that's the sort of length it is and um, this was also available in petite but I feel like this coat could be nice I think the black one would be nicer it's a lot more versatile in black and um, I think this wouldn't really get that much wear one thing I do love is the little zips though I think they're a really cute detail um, to have as a pocket so obviously that flap is just like a false flap and then you just have the zip pocket but yeah this is one that I'm definitely going to be returning so I hope everyone really enjoyed this video if you did remember to give it a thumbs up and if you're new here you can pop on the subscribe button and you'll get an update for sort of new fashion haul style videos every weekend but yeah um, if you do have any questions comments as always please leave them down below and I'll definitely get back to you as soon as possible and of course all of the links will be in the description box and if anything's out of stock I'll try my best to find a good alternative. So yeah, I will see you next week.